guys, this is Katie. Thanks for stopping by my channel. Today we are going to do a simple yet realistic everyday work routine for the summer months. Um, I'm a teacher. I don't work in the summer, but this is what I do when I do have those hot days at the beginning of the year in August or at the end of the year in May, June. Um, just an equal work routine that I think can work on anybody. And I think everything I use is drugstore and I didn't even really intend for that to happen. But um, I hope you guys stick around and see how I did this look. Thanks for stopping by. We're just gonna go ahead and get into it. The first thing I'm going to start with is the L'Oreal True Match Lumi Glotion. And I have this in the shade Light Glow. There is a shade lighter than this, so this actually is the second shade. It's the more bronzy shade. And I'm going to use this as my like base or primer. I already have a moisturizer on. So I'm just going to take a little bit on my fingers and put it all over my face. And even though we're still working, that doesn't mean you can't have a little bit of glow on your face at work since it's the summertime. So I'm going to go in with the L'Oreal True Match Lumi Cushion. Now mine has stickers on it because I got it on sale. But I have the color C3 which is Creamy Natural. And I'm actually just going to use the little puff that comes with it. Um, sometimes I do like to use um, the L'Oreal sponge. But I find that it soaks up a lot of the product. And you don't get a lot for the money in this kind of product. So I'm going to use the little sponge that comes with it. Just to get the most bang for my buck. And I like this because it gives you a lighter coverage. You can build it up to like a light medium, but in the summer, you know, we get tan. Most of our faces start to look a little bit better. Um, my freckles really come out in the summer and I like to let those show through. So I find that this really works and it's really fast to put on. This kind of smooths out your complexion a little bit but still lets your skin show through. So that is the base of the skin. As you can see my freckles are still showing through but it just, I can tell that it just evens out any redness or splotchiness that I have. And then I am going to go in with a little bit of a powder, but not much because I want that glowiness. Um, I'm going to go in with the Physician's Formula Youthful Wear Translucent Illuminating Finish Powder. And then I'm going to go ahead with bronzer. Today I'm going to use the number 7 bronzer in the shade Caramel. And sometimes this is a little bit hard for me to use when I am really light because it does have a little bit of a warm undertone but in the summer it works a lot better. So I'm just going to bronze with it. Girl, we can't be contouring when we're trying to get ready for work. Ain't nobody got time for that. And then I'm going to go in with blush. And you guys know that I love my pink blushes. But I'm trying to expand out of side of my comfort zone a little bit. So I'm going to go in with a new product which is the Burt's Bees Blush in Bare Peach. Okay, so this was my fear with this. It's like not, maybe a little bit. It's not showing up a whole lot on my skin because it is 
tan right now so I'm trying to put a little bit more product on so we can at least see that I have put blush on so you can see some peach there hopefully and then this is not something I always do when I'm getting ready for work um, actually secret I'm a teacher so I don't get ready for work in the summer um, I know rough life but if I was and in like the fall and the later spring months when I am teaching I do like to add a little bit of a healthy glow to the cheeks so I'm going to use another new product which is the covergirl vitalist healthy glow it is their highlighter but it's like a creamy cushion type highlighter and it's just like a really pretty um bronzy highlight and the more tan you are the more you can reach for those bronzier colors for your highlight So I don't need to go ham with the highlight because this is just work. We're not trying to impress anybody. At least I'm not. I teach 7th graders so that would be weird. So I hope you're catching that glow. It gives you a little glow without being like pew, strobes in your face which is just kind of unnecessary for a typical job scene I am going to put a little bit down my nose and you can totally skip this step um, if you want to for like a summer work routine because we don't all need to be highlighting for work I think that completes the face I am going to go in with a little bit of concealer and I'm going to use my usual which is the Maybelline fit me concealer in the shade fair I probably could go um, down a shade I know to the next darker shade which is the shade light but I'm gonna use this because it just kind of highlights under the eyes at the same time as concealing a little bit but I'm not gonna put a lot on kind of bring it down to that triangle shape but like not go overboard like a lot of people do okay so hopefully you can see that that just brightens up under the eyes a little bit and above the cheekbones I'm not an eyebrow person especially when I'm getting for work I'm just not gonna take the time to like do my eyebrows just because I have dark eyebrows and I mean they're not extremely thick and they could use some shading or whatever but when I'm getting ready for work that's just not something I think about so the next thing I'm going to do is go in with the eyes and I like to use a liquid liner for work because it does stay all day and I do create a little teeny wing with it not like a super out there wing because I feel like that's unnecessary for work as well but I'm going to go in with the NYC liquid eyeliner in black super 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 affordable I'm not even going in with a shadow as you may have noticed because I just don't have time for that some days For the wing, I just kind of pretend that my lower lash line extends and that's where I make the teeny tiny wing. The reason I do a teeny wing is just because teeny wing kind of sounds like I was going to say teeny wiener. <laughs> Maybe that's just me. It's just so it lifts your eyes if you're looking really tired, which most days I am for work because I'm not a morning person so it just kind of lifts your eyes a little bit and makes it look like they're more wide awake than they might be okay so those are the wings 
they're not twins, but whatevs, dude. Now, for this next part, what I would normally do is just take a black eyeliner, like pencil liner or coal eyeliner, like um, my favorite is the L'Oreal Carbon Black Infallible Never Fail Eyeliner, the 16 hour wear one. Um, and I would take this, oh, the end just came off. I would take this and just put it like right on my lower lash line, not like a harsh defined line at all. But since it is summer, you may want to put a little pop of color on, even if it is work, just for fun and if you love makeup. So I have these two eyeliners that I think would be awesome for like a summer pop of color for work for the lower lash line. And they are by Maybelline. They're the Lasting Drama Waterproof Gel pencils and one is in like a tur turquoise and one's in like a sapphire so i think today i'm going to go with the probably the sapphire one just on my lower lash line From far away, you may not be able to tell that you have some bright color or bold color on your lower lash line, which is okay, but close up, um, you can definitely tell. And then, of course, I'm going to go in with a mascara and <sighs> alert, sound the alarm. I am not using my tried and true every day, can't put it down. CoverGirl Clump Crusher in L'Oreal Voluminous with the curved brush. However, I am using the L'Oreal Voluminous Lash Paradise, which I'm sure a lot of you have heard of if you haven't already been using it or tried it out. So I'm just going to go ahead and pop that on the lashes. Hey, okay, and this mascara does a really great job of lifting your lashes up putting a great thick coat of mascara on your lashes. So this is what the eyes look like with the lashes and that pop of color of liner on the bottom. Okay, and the last thing we are going to do um, is a simple yet effective lip color. So I always recommend Never to skip blush or a simple lip color to make your look complete. Um, and I, for that, I am going to use um, the Stila Stay All Day um, Liquid Lipstick in the shade Caramello. Um, this is obviously a mini one. But I wore this shade to a wedding the other weekend and I really liked it. For like that nudie pink summer color that would work um, for like an everyday work color as well. That looks like on its own. In the summer when you're tan it can be a little pale. So I am going to put a more pinky gloss on top of it because I want this to add the pigment, the color, but then the pinky sheen on top of it will give us a gloss and a little bit pull out the more pink undertones in this gloss or in this liquid. I am going to use the NYX Butter Gloss in the shade Eclair. It's kind of a baby pink, but I think on top of this, it'll be a good summer pink everyday color that you can wear to work. So this is the nudie pink lip. Um, the liquid lipstick um, works because it'll help your makeup stay on or your lipstick stay on all throughout the day. Um, the gloss you may just want to put in your purse and reapply throughout the day as you go. But that base color should remain on because the Stila liquid lips do stay all day. Um, and then, of course, you can go ahead and set it with the setting spray. I am going to use the Milani Make It Dewy setting spray 
because in the summer we want the dew. <sighs> Just douse yourself in it, ladies. It's going to go ahead and complete this look for your simple everyday summer work routine with a little bit of a pop of color. And if you're not comfortable with that, go ahead and use your black or brown. Or if you want to go for a more bold color, do like a turquoise or a bright green or something like that. But um, thanks for watching this video, guys, and I hope you come back for more. See ya! Whew. Thought I was gonna sneeze. Easy, realistic, simple, I said simple, oh, ugh.